Google Plus for iPhone received a recent update, adding a new feature that just might make you get more involved with the service, if you're not already. Hi, I'm Jason Parker, and this is a first look at the latest update to Google Plus for iPhone. Google's social network has struggled somewhat because many people are already on Facebook and Twitter and wonder why would they want to join yet another social network. With the new version of Google Plus for iPhone, a new feature addition could bring more iPhone users into the fold. Stream is the lifeblood of Google Plus, showing you a feed of shared links, videos, and messages from people in your circles. In the new version for the iPhone, Google has incorporated large, richly colored images into Stream that load smoothly as you scroll through, improving the overall browsing experience. You can add your plus one to a post in Stream by touching the number in the lower right, or you can touch anywhere on the image to see a preview of the post, make comments, and add your plus one there if you approve. With the new look, Stream almost feels like a blog feed, showing stories and posts chronologically. It's very straightforward and easy on the eyes, and might be the interface feature that makes Facebook users start to want to spend more time on Google+. One drawback to the new look is that you can't read comments in Stream without touching the image and going to the next screen, forcing you to switch back and forth on every post. While it adds an extra step, the new look definitely gives the app a better feel, so we'll have to see how iPhone users respond. It's important to note that there is still no version of Google Plus that is made for the iPad, but you can use the iPhone app on your iPad with pixel doubling. While functional, it doesn't look nearly as good, so you may just want to stick with using Google Plus on the iPhone. You can get the latest version of Google Plus right now for your iPhone in the iTunes App Store or by updating the app on your iPhone. I'm Jason Parker from CNET, and this has been a first look at the latest version of Google Plus for iPhone. Thanks for watching.